Hey, what's happening, guys? Have you ever found yourself with um, some unknown transistors and you don't know what the pinouts are or whether they're PNP or NPN? Well, I'm going to show you a little technique you can use to figure out which. All you need is a multimeter. Put it in diode mode. Now, one of these is PNP, one is NPN. So we'll grab this one to start with. I'm just going to spread out the legs a little so they don't touch. Doesn't matter what color you put where or where you start. So we'll just start with the negative lead on the left hand side. And then we'll touch this one to the middle. Open loop. Open loop. Okay. Then we'll move this over to the middle. Okay. Now we got something. 0.731. Point seven three two. All right, here's the first trick in this little technique. The base emitter junction will always be a little bit stronger than the base collector junction. So we now know that since this middle lead was common to both of these, that's your base. And because this was stronger, looks point seven three four seven three three. So this would be the emitter. This will go emitter, base, collector. And it should be PNP because the base is negative. So to verify that, we can just bring in the component tester and check it out. One, that's this one, is emitter. Two is base, three is collector. And it's PNP. Pretty cool, right? All right, let's try it with the other one. We'll do it the same way because it doesn't matter where we start. We'll clip that one there. We'll touch the center. Nothing. Whoop, center, we got something. 0.678. Nothing. Then we can move this over one. Nothing. Nothing. Move this over again. Nothing. Oh, there we go. 0. 0.670. Nothing. So what have we found so far? That, again, the middle pin is common to both. So that's the base. Now we just need to see which one is stronger. 678. 671. So again, we will be emitter, base, collector. And since we are positive on our base, this will be an NPN transistor. We'll put it in the component tester just to verify. There you go, emitter, base, collector, this time an NPN. So this is just a super simple technique that will allow you to identify unknown bipolar transistors. I hope you got some help out of this. I hope you learned something. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Big thanks to all the patrons. That's it. I'm out. Peace.